October 25th. We're going to try to get this bitch turned on today. Um, battery charged. Put about five gallons of uh, fuel. Added the coolant. I do have two little small baby leaks. Uh, one from the upper radiator hose, which I need smaller clamps. And um, from the, the turbo, uh, I'm going to have to replace the fittings with uh, stainless steel braided fittings, lines. And uh, so everything's been double, if not quadruple checked. Coils, fuel, timing. Uh, timing's been checked more than 10 times. Making sure everything's lined up. Everything's torqued to the specs. Um, hydraulic tensioner set to the proper um, set uh, specs as well. Uh, DSM link, everything's set up to where to get the vehicle the motor started up and driving gonna worry about tuning down the road so this is gonna be the first attempt uh, crossing fingers So right off the bat, uh, I don't hear the fuel pump priming. Um, I'm going to have to check the wiring on that. Before, I, I would hear it wind up real loud. And um, I don't have the back seats in. There's no carpet, so I'm going to have to take off that top cover and double check the wiring in the back and then also check on link if there's a open circuit 
But uh, I mean, everything cranks. I don't hear anything getting stuck. Um, I do smell some fuel up here in the front. I mean, who knows? It might it's probably very, very low voltage on the battery. I'm reading 12.5 on the uh, on the little turbo timer I have, and um, so I'm gonna have to work backwards and check from there. Also, I need to check the ignition, make sure you know, double check that I'm getting spark.